The history of Goldman Sachs spans 150 years, and to celebrate that history, the bank collaborated with noted historical documentary filmmaker Rick Burns to create a 10-part series chronicling the financial giant from its humble beginnings to now. Goldman Sachs at 150 debuts next Monday on Amazon Prime, and Yahoo Finance has the exclusive trailer. Take a look. What is it about this organization, about its culture, about its history, about its people that's allowed it to be nimble? adapt, adjust, move forward, pick itself up when it's been knocked down, and really get stronger for it every step of the way. I think one has to remember that financial history is an evolutionary story. For every Goldman Sachs, there were a hundred small dealers in commercial paper in the late 19th century who never lasted longer than 10 years. And it's a process of almost Darwinian natural selection, a combination of luck and success that gets Goldman Sachs from its relatively humble beginnings to the Goldman Sachs we know today. I'm not sure that Marcus Goldman ever contemplated that what he began would end up the enterprise it is today. This is the story of the kid from the mailroom who went on to run the firm for many decades. Sydney was the investment banking aspect of the firm. Gus was a market guy, and uh, Gus came along and he liked trading. And here you had the two leaders of, you know, two generations about Wall Street that were at the same firm. So that got the ball rolling in both areas in a big way. Gus came from fairly humble origins in New Orleans. He only had one year of university. Keep in mind, these are two guys who had served in combat in the Second World War. They were determined to make of their lives something of consequence, and they wanted to do it with Goldman Sachs being a firm of consequence. The whole world has seen huge changes in financial markets of all kinds. I don't think any good head of a financial services company, a big bank or an investment bank, can ever sleep too well at night. Those couple of years, those partner meetings, you could hear a pin drop. What has been revealed is that we have a big influence on the world, and the world is entitled, therefore, to have a big influence on us. Where can we change and grow to create the Goldman Sachs of the future? And it's just a super vibrant, agile, constantly changing organism. There are very few companies that ever make it to 150 years, and even fewer that make it to 150 years with the same name that they started with. I'm close to tears. I don't know what to say. I, I, uh, Julia LaRoche, actually, you were the one that uh, talked to Goldman, got this uh, trailer here. Tell us a little bit about this. I mean, is this like a real documentary, or so is this was, like an advertising that documentary? That was a 150-second long trailer, if yeah. you didn't notice. Uh, it's a 10-part series spanning 150 years, 150 minutes. And Rick Burns, who is a historical documentarian, actually uh, worked with them years ago, about a decade ago, for just an internal series. And now with the 150th anniversary, Anniversary, they are updating that, releasing it to the public. And keep in mind, uh, 10 years ago, this was a very closed up firm that didn't do too much with the public or the media. And that did transform post crisis, them opening up more, telling their story. And I actually don't know the full story behind Marcus Goldman. I have read books where he's in it, but um, I. I think it's interesting. Maybe it's a good tool for people to just learn about the company. Rick Burns did say he learned a lot about capitalism, something that he didn't necessarily know too much about, and just the history of the world from the point of view of Goldman Sachs and their evolution. Do we know, like, did they interview people like Matt Taibbi or anything like that? No, I mean, I know. I'm, no, I'm, totally I'm serious. I well, Warren Buffett's in it, and they yeah. interviewed 50, 60, 70 people for the series. So, I mean, there's an audience for it. And it's on Amazon Prime. And someone in the trailer says evolution, which I, <laughs> I did think that was kind of table stakes for that one. Maybe they will say aluminum, aluminum in the 150 next. minutes. Exactly. Great. It's I'm, a global firm, so. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure, yeah, I know, we're mean. We're, we like that. We like the way they talk, right? We're not being mean. No, it's we fine. Like it. yeah. I'm going to watch I'm it. I'm a nerd. It. I'm definitely going to watch it. I'm going to watch it, too. All right, all right. I'm watching it, too.